Hello and welcome to Force 13's latest prediction for the upcoming Northern Hemisphere Cyclone Seasons. 2025 marks our 10th season of forecasts and we didn't quite catch the April predictions, it uh, passed us by somewhat, but we are here for the proper predictions, which have always been the proper predictions, the May 31st ones, and we're happy to bring that to you here on the eve of Atlantic hurricane season. North Indian Ocean, we had two systems that formed in the last week, I don't know if you saw it, there was that tropical depression uh, that only just clinched tropical depression before making landfall along the coast of western India, and then, uh, out of nothing really, a few days ago, we had that very broad uh, tropical disturbance. If you saw that on the tropical weather bulletins or on some of our social media. And we did call that a fully fledged tropical storm just as it was making landfall for about six hours before it weakened off. So, that is already one tropical storm for the tally. With that in mind, we're giving a full total here of six tropical storms, one category one hurricane equivalent, and one major category three equivalent. So it's looking like a fairly standard season there in the North Indian Ocean as well. Where are the potential hotspots? It's probably going to be the Bay of Bengal region, usually is. Eastern India, Andhra Pradesh, one of the big spots in the later season when we get to October, as well as further north, right up to West Bengal towards Bangladesh, possibly in the mid-season, uh, but more likely to be towards the October-November period, which is where we get that proper big peak late on in the year. Of course, different climate different kind of climatology in the North Indian Ocean where we have two distinct peaks in May and in October. Well the May peak hasn't been that bad so far we've only got a 40 mile an hour tropical storm uh, so we're probably going to be looking towards October but you can't rule out more storms in June even July and in the other months roundabout. We have our numbers for the 2025 upcoming seasons. It's taken a lot of research that we've put into this. Uh, we hope we've done a good job. It's not infallible, absolutely not. Um, and the conditions do change throughout the year. Um, and like I said as well, in fact I don't think I've said this yet, but looking at the El Nino uh, Enso pattern, it is pretty neutral, which means that there's a lot of uncertainty. And even the ENSO forecast is quite uncertain because we don't know if we might just pop up into a positive for a while, maybe even getting towards a weak El Nino, or whether we'll just be uh, staying neutral and then dropping back down towards the La Nina towards the end of the season. You can uh, react to all of this on our Discord server. You can check out discord.gg slash force13 uh, to chat with other weather watchers from around the world. Join discussion. You can also find all of our social Social media links on our link tree uh, and you can also join the team if you want to help us out during our coverage this season uh, and be on our streams and uh, help give out really important information at really crucial times uh, please send us a message you can email us contact at force13.com or get in touch through one of those afore aforementioned outlets